Yo, what's up? This is Patrick from Guy in the Cube. And in this Two Minute Tuesday, I'm gonna show you how to delete a report that's been copied from one workspace to another workspace and even in my workspace. Okay, so I did a video not too long ago talking about copying reports from one workspace to another workspace and even to your my workspace and somebody asked me a really cool question a question that i didn't even, i didn't think about covering in the initial video and that was hey patrick now that i've copied the report how do i delete the report but more importantly how do i delete the data set the link data set from the workspace right and so i was like hmm Great question. And so instead of just typing it up, the question there, I decided, you know what I'm gonna do, right? Let's just answer the question with a video. So instead of all this talking, you guys know what I like to do, let's head over to my laptop. All right, so this is a workspace. I'm logged in as a you know member of the workspace, uh, John Doe, and he's copied some reports. Uh, and, he's, and, it, and when he copied the report, it also created a link data set. And you can see right here, here's the link data set and this is the report. So it's really easy to just delete the report. All you need to do is find the little, find the report, find the little delete icon, click it. It's gonna say, hey, do you wanna permanently delete this? Of course I do. Go ahead and click the delete button, and bam, just like that, the report deletes. If I go over to the data set tab and just give it a second or so, maybe give it a quick refresh, just toggle away, toggle back, or give the browser a quick refresh, Hmm, that link data set should automatically disappear. But, right, there's one thing that you gotta make sure you do. Any other reports that's dependent on that data set must also be removed. A quick way to identify any artifacts that's related to that data set, all you need to do is go to that link data set, click on the view related icon, and you'll see, hey, there's another report. There's another report associated to this. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna go back to the reports um, section and go ahead and delete that report also because I don't want anything associated to that data set in the workspace. That's the only way that data set will be removed automatically by Power BI. So I'm gonna go ahead and delete it. Wait just a couple of seconds. Head back over to my data set tab. Still there, give it a quick, give the browser a quick refresh and bam, the data set is automatically removed, okay? So basically what you gotta do is, first you delete all the reports that are dependent on that data set. If you don't know which ones they are, go over to the data set, click on the view related icon, it'll give you a list of all those reports. Then you can make sure you really wanna delete all the artifacts associated, associated with the data set. And then what'll happen is, in just a few short seconds, Power BI, the service, will automatically remove that data set from your workspace, all right? What do you guys think? You got any questions, comments? You know what to do. Post it in the comments below. If it's your first time visiting the Guy in the Cube channel, hit that subscribe button. If you like my video, give me a big thumbs up. As always, from Adam and myself, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.